Hey everybody, Heather from Mook Down Pickin', and yes, it's James. Hello. So he's back, so he's going to do an unboxing wars with us. So we're going to find out who wins. Last time Amy won the unboxing wars, so she did an awesome job. And so we're going to choose which box we're going to unbox, and we're going to show 10 items. Um, and then at the end, we'll find out who picked the most expensive of the 10 items and who wins. Uh, we also will get to keep one thing. From the boxes. It can oh. be from either box. So the winner gets to pick first what they want to keep and they can pick from, you can either pick from my box or your box. Okay. So uh, we're going to go ahead and do unboxing wars. All right, so we're here. We're going to unbox. But first, our first choice is we have to pick which boxes we want to unbox. So I have this set and then James, you have that set down there. So mm -hmm. pick it up, feel it, go ahead. Uh, which box do you want to Pray over it, James. Which box... Do you feel the Lord wants you to take? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for like him to cry. Heather, you, you, you want to double check one. yours there? Yes. Which one are you going to go with here, the over here? The heavier one. Which one is the heavier one? This one right here. All right, let's kind of scoot the other one out of the way then yeah, for they you. They both say the 30 pounds, they're lying. This one is yeah. 30 pounds. Mine says it's 29 pounds. Ooh. I'm picking the 29 pound one. This one says it's 21 pounds and it clearly feels lighter so we're gonna i'm gonna do what james does i'm gonna copycatting him and we're gonna pick the heavy one as well all right, all right so james. they're gonna pick the top 10 things out of each of the boxes uh go ahead and open your boxes guys and let's see what you got in there give me a second to peek inside here in just a moment and then once they find their 10 we're gonna take a break and then i'll i'll tally up what the cost is so they won't be doing that so it's fair that way we'll see who wins Ooh, lots of goodies in there, Heather. This is James is here. I got straws. Ooh. Looks like a party pack. All right, awesome. go ahead and dig through. Okay. And then once you find uh, one item that you're going to stick with, then let me know. Okay. Yep. James, if you would scoot your box down there a little bit further away from mom's that way, that way you can start uh, so you stacking your pile. Side, um, you know what, if you scoot yours all the way down that way. Okay. Perfect. And then I'll line then up you can line it right down here on the nice clear table there. I'm going to pick this very descriptive, nondescript white. Going container. mystery. Because I've got multiples of those in there. So that's Going my number one. Going total mystery. Nice. All right. Very good. Uh, Mama's got her one there. Excuse me. Heather's got her one there. I don't know what this is, but I'm picking it. It has weight to it. So obviously Ooh. that means it's good. Could be something good. What do we got here, Heather? I think I'm going to just pick this black box. Oh, neat is. box. I'm not sure what it is. I would have definitely picked that box. All right, so there's my number It even two. looks old. Yeah. Could have parts of the Ark of the Covenant in it. You don't know. All right, I'll pick another one here. You're going to pick this another one? It says all day design. I don't know what it is. All day design. So we're just going to pick that one. I just like the big, big boxes. All right. I'm digging it. I'm going to pick this one. Yeah. It's like a zebra. The zebra box. <laughs> it's going to destroy the video quality, but it's awesome. That's what, blue Monaco? They right. make they make the best stuff. I don't know what that is. How about I'm you grab another one? This. Actually, this one. I'll pick this one. So, I think it's a clock. Time works wonders. But I'm not certain. How about you grab another one? And, ooh, whatever this is. It's a wedding box. Trying to tell it's you something, James. Wedding in a box. It's an entire, entire wedding. Out, and then just people to start getting married. A little preacher in there. Yeah. Okay, this is a random brown box. I like it. Okay. You guys are doing a great job. And then I'm going to pick this random brown box. Ran small, small could be more expensive. It can be. That's what jewelry's in, you know? Yeah. All right, Heather's got five. James has got four. I'm going to pick this. Oh, there you go. So, this. Might might be the, that flower and vase, but you don't know. Yeah. I'm also going to pick this. I, it's completely, there's nothing on this. It's just a box. Exactly. To tell you. There what do we got? You got six items there? Right now, yeah. Let's see. Heather's got five. Got to get her up to at least six here. Okay, this kind of looks like my other one, but it's skinnier. So, so I'm going to so, pick that. So there's something different about it. Yeah. And then I'm going to pick, this is like a piece of fabric. But it's weird. Yeah. I have no idea. Is that padding around something? I don't know. Well, I'm going to pick it anyway. Well, we'll find out. 
And this looks like... So you like, got four, five, six, seven. You're going to get another one there? This looks like a very... It's really heavy, but it looks like it's the size of a Kleenex box. It's not a Kleenex box, but it's very, very heavy. Could be a figurine of some sort. Could be. All right. So what do you got? You got eight now? I've got eight. You've got eight. James, we've got to get you up to eight items now. All right. I'm going to pick the complete mystery, whatever this is. I don't know. I'm just picking a lot of boxes. Uh, I, I like your strategy. Like, there's almost like no thought in it. Yeah, and I like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's because I'm gonna all... pick this. It also is nondescript. <laughs> all of his so... brain power is going to college right now. <laughs> so I will put it here. All right. So you've got eight already now. Yep. You've got eight. Heather's got eight. All Heather, right. why don't you pick your last two here? Okay. This is very mystery. So we're gonna pick that. And. Oh, looks like we got some. that's cool. I don't think it's circles be worth and it. squares, magnetic shapes. I don't think it's gonna be worth a lot, but we can still sell it. You know, Absolutely, we might, might put it on fire sale or something. Um, yes. oh, here, there we go. That's totally okay. undescript. I'm gonna get this one. So, let's see here. So, is that your 10 there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, Heather's got her 10. Let's see if James has got his 10. Mm. I'm probably going to pick this because it says America on it. It does say. And also this because it's an eagle. Is it an eagle? I don't know. I don't know why you'd need this, but America. So there you go. There you go. <laughs> so God bless America. All right, James, go ahead and have your 10 here on the blue table, if you would. And then, James, let's go through and look at some of the items. Uh, unless it's a duplicate item. We don't want to show the duplicate item. Yep, this is a duplicate item. That was now. a duplicate, yep. I think the rest are not duplicate items. Let's go uh, ahead and see. Besides this, this is a duplicate item. Yeah, that looks like a duplicate. So let's see. What else do you, did you so not choose? I skipped over this. Um, it's a party pack of It looks sort. like a party pack. Like It looks like it has a Hawaiian skirt, the little tiki umbrellas, the straws. Mm -hmm. So it's like hey, a party pack. You could take that to college with you and have like a little Hawaiian thing. Now, like on a December... Luau. Like December 6th. Wow. You should yes. throw a luau. I will not be there on December 6th. Because oh, you won't? break in November. Yeah. Really? Yeah. For Thanksgiving are, you, are you home the whole month of December is what I'm saying? Yes. Are you really? Yeah. All right. Then January 12th. <laughs> oh, yeah. You should have throw a luau. So. There we go. Why the random dates? I'm not I... sure. Cold. I'm thinking cold. Oh. It doesn't this make sense. This looks like... I don't know. Am I good to take it out? Yeah. Yes. Go ahead. Okay. Was it a backdrop? It might be a backdrop. It makes sense to it. Yeah, it looks like it. Here, un unravel the whole thing. Oh. I think this, hold this corner up. Okay. Wait, does it go this way? Goes this way. Okay. I think go. you guys are upside down. Is oh, it upside down? Me? Yep, that's a oh, buffalo, a buffalo upside down. Oh, okay, yep. here. Take that corner. <laughs> That would have been sweet, James. It's a buffalo tapestry. There you go. Everyone needs one. Every time I hear well the word done. buffalo, I want to start singing the water We also skipped this. I think this needs to go to you. Oh. What's it say? Uh, you can unwrap it. Okay. Yeah, it's hard to see through all of the bubble wrap. Basically, what all these products are, they are from Amazon. For some reason or other, they got delisted from Amazon. And who knows why? There you go. The only thing better than having you as my dad is my children having you as their papa. Why does he need that? What do I, I need don't that? know. I couldn't read half of it okay. when it was in the thing. I Very just good. read dad, and I'm like, okay. Wonderful. <laughs> Let's see. And then this. This is super light. Oh. Oh, oh, nice. That's cool. That's kind of cool. And then this is a stand to stand Yeah. On. I like the clock. Pretty tree. That's kind that, of That would have been nice there. There you go. Probably been worth a little bit of money there. Let's see. We got this. Uh, beads? Beads, looks like. Black beads. beads. And, black beads and then a string to, okay. to make like necklaces. Like a stuff. little craft little thing. Yeah. And then this. All right, we have, might have to be careful. Should I open Mama it? got one of those that was inappropriate. Let me open oh. this one. Yeah, it had not good pictures. It, it was, was like, it was, it was uh, anime, what is it, an anime? But it was oh, not good yeah. pictures. Sometimes it was, they were a little too. Uh, no, these are just. They're better. Oh, oh, eh, stuff. it's not. Peppers. 
Are these Smith? I don't. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, just kind of like just football. Yeah. Things. Maybe you could hang them all over the wall and they'd make a cool could art piece. Could be. It says Carolina Panthers. Okay. Okay. There you All go. right. Very good. All right, Heather, let's see what was in your box that you didn't go ahead and pick. Well, we already saw the cool magnetic squares, but we can look at them a little closer, and they have a really neat picture on the back. I like it. So that you kind of see what they are. So Some kids love these things. We have a lot of people requesting, like, these, these yep. stem or building type of toys. We do. Seem to always sell. This has tassels. And like a bar to hold it, so I think it's like some sort of an anime. It's an anime banner. I think that's Dragon Ball Z. Dragon, Dragon Ball, Ball Z, Z banner. Mm -hmm. Good thing James the expert is Great. here. Great. And we have clip-on eyeglasses or sunglasses. Very important to have. You had more in your box. Yeah. What's this? That looks fancy. They're both down here, James. Oh, I got you. He was wanting me to flip it around. So. This is a red velvety box. If I would have saw that, I would have picked it. I know. Um, these things will probably be available on the next... Uh, so you can actually email us and mm -hmm. tell us if you want some of these items. Ooh, look at that. Fancy. It's fancy. Wow. It's an <laughs> empty box. Yes. Yes. I'm glad you didn't see it. So I'm glad I didn't it. see it. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta buy empty boxes, you know. This is like incense cones. Sure. These are little party favor boxes with tags. So that's what all these are. Got these are little decor piece miniature fairy garden glow in the dark flower set of three. Very important to have. More pretty boxes. This is a duplicate, so I'm not going to open that one yet. Mm, do I have a box yes. like that? Yeah, that's a duplicate too. Mm -hmm. And this is really heavy. I feel like this is a duplicate of one of the things James has. Could be. But we'll open this at the end uh, just to make sure that the duplicates yep. are not actual duplicates. And what is this? This looks like a keychain. says Sheriff on it. Like a leather. Oh, we need that. Hold on. Let me just get it out because it looks really cool actually. Oh, it's a Velcro. It goes on a sheriff's uh, bag, maybe? Maybe. You know, because we have military ones like that. Yeah, you know? see it's got even the blue line thing. There you go. Boom. Yep. Sheriff. All right, cool. If you're a sheriff, so we have your tag. So now we're going to open the things? Absolutely. Okay, so what they're trying to do is, James has his 10. <laughs> Heather has her 10. We're going to find out what is the most valuable. James, you go ahead and start trying to open one here. Okay. Are you good with me starting with James, or do yeah, you want to start us, Heather? Cool. And then... Um, yeah, we'll see what it is, and then afterwards we'll go through and check the I have price. a bunch of mini flamingos. Yeah, you do. Like a bunch of mini flamingos. Oh, and bunnies. Of course, they go together, you know. Oh, no, just one bunny. Just, just one bunny. Just one singular bunny. Yep. And a bunch of flamingos. Well done, James. They're all slightly different flamingos. Which I think makes it that much better. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll line them up over Probably here. Probably at so least $47 worth of flamingos. There. Obviously, obviously. Yep. Those are cute. They're just awesome. little like plastic. You can put them on a cake. You can put them as decor pieces. James, tell me, are you impressed with your flamingos? I'm impressed with my flamingos. Are you really? I am, I am excited that I got flamingos. Excellent job, James. So we have flamingos. Heather, right. what's your first one you're going to go with? I'm going to open this one. Very light. Barely... Uh, Barely weighs anything. Foam pieces here. ACDC. AC DC. Out of a vinyl record. Out of a vinyl record. Somebody's going to like that. Is this actually... Battery clock? Yep. yep. Battery clock. Battery clock. That's cool. Yeah. That oh, clock. That cool. was a clever idea to do with records, too. You get yeah. some old records, and nobody knows what to do with them. And I think they're actually genuine records. Yeah. So we've gotten a few of these. So we're going to price all these things, right, to find out how much they Absolutely are. Absolutely. And then you will. can um, you can offer to buy them. Yep. After you see this video, just send us an email. 100%. All right, James, which is the next one you're going to go with? I'm going to go with this big, like, black and white zebra box. I like it. 
What is this? Oh. Oh. It's gonna have some kind of was that organizing? Yeah. Supplies. Looks like an office supply set, but it's, it's a gold. nice one. It's really nice, yeah. Like this is for like papers, letters, and letters and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. It's nice. That's, That's a nice little notes. set. This and you got a very non-functional cup. Yep. You can fill it up with water for about half a second. Half a second. And that's it, because there are holes Or everywhere. you put pins in it. You see, that makes too much sense. Yeah. So, you know. You know. We can't be doing that. It's true. But yeah, it's really cool. That actually might be worth a little bit of money. Yeah. The whole set like that. We'll find out. Heather, which one are you going to go okay, with? This has me intrigued. I have no idea what it is. Hmm. It's like vacuum sealed. I don't know. Do I want to open it all the way? I guess we have to. Probably never get back in the bag, but hey. That's all right. That's the fun of the video. We'll just put it in a bigger box. To ship. I think it is vacuum sealed. <laughs> Once you cut the vacuum and it expands the eight feet long or something. Well, it's a pillow. With a button in the middle. <laughs> yes, nice. it is. It's like a throw pillow. James James is staring at the pillow like, what is this? It's an alien pillow. It's, it's, it's a pillow. Somebody's going to love that pillow. Marty, nice. I'm going to stay in here and take a nap while you do James's. Okay. okay. I like the pillow. All right. Let's see what this box is. It has no label, which means it's obviously a million dollars. Could be. You don't know. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Yep. That's what I'm going for. Oh, it's a bunch of stuff. They all seem to be the same thing it looks looks like. Oh. Oh, oh nice. Kind of like that. So it's a whole so, box. How many whole box of those picture frames. That's nice. It's kind of like a distressed wood look there. Are they all the same just like that? Uh, it looks like it, yeah. It's like a whole box of this here. What yeah. is this, Heather? Is that a 5x8? That's a 4x6. Four 4x6. Four Definitely somebody's going to want that. Yeah. You can definitely theme an area. That's nice. That actually might do well, James. Yeah. Very nondescript. This is item GNWA006-103F. That's what we're looking at I'm here. excited for yeah. it. Yeah. Are you? Just by the description so alone. Fun. What? It's a filter. <gasps> it's a filter. You need this filter. That goes to who knows what. Right? Maybe that number was actually a really it's, important it's a, thing to read. It's a part number, filter number. Yes. If anybody knows. Here, you can read the rest of it. What that is, we have it. <laughs> Good job. Okay. Good job, Heather. All right. I actually have a way to find the, vol the value of that. Okay. All Tiny right. Mini nondescript box this time. Mini box. What in the world? So it's got like building stuff. A little hardware inside. Still can't tell what it is. I think Rylan bubble wraps that. Oh yeah. Rylan, when she bubble wraps stuff, it's her goal to make sure that you can't tell what it is when it's done bubble wraps because oh. how much bubble wrap she puts. Oh. It's on brand. It's hooks. What? It is on brand. Hooks. It was made for us. James Hooks, you just opened a, a hook. I did. Multiple hooks, actually. Just... Oh, so it goes into the wall. Yep. Oh. And it's really kind of like the, scroll worky. That is nice actually. Yep. So the three that hooks, look three hooks. Three they're right cast there. iron. Hey, we have we have three little hooks. We do. It's true. It was designed for our family. It's yes. true. We have three three hooks children. This is kind of yeah. nice. Good job, James. All right, we're going to we're going to open the very heavy Kleenex box is what I called it. Ooh, it has some fun designs Design. on it. Look at that. <laughs> Our workers over there are having too much fun while packaging. Yeah, they are. It's all a good time with hooks on picking. Oh, it's a candle. What? That's a candle? Yeah. It's a nice Ooh, candle. It smells really good, too. Hold on, let me smell it. Ooh, did you guys smell that? That was really good. This says 93% um, soy wax, pure plant flavor. It smelled like a pure plant. Did it? What's the scent? It doesn't say the scent. It just says... Check on the writing on the candle. 
Well, keep going. Keep turning the candle there. I didn't There's say the a scent. right in the middle of the. Oh, this. Yep. Oh, French Cade and lavender. There you go. French what? Cade. French Cade. French Cade and lavender. Every time I smell a French Cade, I'm like, that smells just like a French Cade. Yep. Mm -hmm. Comment down below if you smelled a French Cade. Yeah, absolutely. All right, which one's next, James? Uh, let's go with this one. So I think could it be a be plant, plant, but we'll see. We opened one uh, last time we did this and it was broken, so hopefully it's not broken. Yeah, Lord willing, it is. So, sometimes we have problems with it. it. Definitely looks like a plant. Sorry, it's completely <laughs> upside down. There you go. You know what? Maybe it's designed that way. I say we flip it. That's how you should. It's yes. a very interesting hat. I can do this. It could be a hat. I think I could rock this. You could rock that. Absolutely. Yeah. I've seen some things at your spirit week at school. Absolutely, yeah. This would be normal. Yeah. Yes, normal. Listen, he lives normal. in a guy's yeah. dorm. Anything is yeah. normal. There's not a plant in a guy's dorm. That's what are we talking about? Nice. You could bring that and have your own plant and it won't ever die. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> but you should still water it <laughs> every morning. <laughs> you should still water it. <laughs> get like no, a no, spray no. bottle. You're gonna, you're gonna get, the, you're gonna get the cup over there, and you'll water it with that cup. Yeah. <laughs> Just spilling water all over the floor. <laughs> Trying to do That'd it. That'd be great. Be awesome. Yeah, believe it or not, somebody's gonna want that, and it's probably worth at least ten bucks. But we'll I'll have to look it up and box see. Too, to yeah. To mm -hmm. Ship it with. So it's not a bad pick, James. All right, I'm gonna right. this one. This was that some kind of home design piece? Yes, all day design is what it says. All day design. I think it opens this way. <clears throat> oh, hangers. Hangers. Pants hangers. But they're really, really cute. Really pants nice colors. hangers. Yeah, they're pants hangers. Really nice pants hangers. For your slacks. Slacks? Yes. My grandma always calls them. Yep. So we got a set of pants hangers. Fancy pants. Fancy pants hangers. F fancy pants. <laughs> For any of you people with fancy, fancy pants. pants. <laughs> All right, which one now? Hmm. Let's go with this one. I don't know what this is, but it looks, it's heavy. Could be a pair of fancy pants. Could be. See that? I don't know. Whoa. Ooh. We got something similar to this last My time. My loving grandpa. Here you have to. Can you tilt it up? I, I'm getting a glare. There we go. My loving grandpa. My grandpa. My rock. By somebody Hawkins. Beautiful. And it has a little stand where it stands up, just like the one we. It's had glass. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's it's that's fancy. pretty nice. It's not pants, but it's fancy. And now you have something for <laughs> grandparent day. I do. At least for grandpa. All right. Okay. Wasn't sure what this was. You got it, Heather. I believe in you. Thanks. Oh, Ooh, this is a diamond, diamond dot. Yeah. What is it? It's a. Uh, hmm. It's. I think it's the Lion King. It scene. is the Lion King. What is that? That's when they're singing uh, Akuma Matata or something Akuma like that. Matata. Yeah, because it's it's Simba. Um. Timon and Pumbaa. Timon and Pumbaa. Yep. I said those so. wrong completely, but that's fun. All right, cool. So it's a Diamond Dots. We actually were talking to a girl at uh, um, this weekend at yeah. our church that does the Diamond Dots. She thing. does. Yeah. Yep. Sunday we were talking to her about. All right, which one, James? All right, let's go with this one. Hmm. Time works wonders. Another clock, maybe? Probably. That's what I'm thinking. But. Or a time machine. It's a time machine? Yeah, that's probably more accurate. Hey, if you have a time machine, would you go back and turn in that assignment on time? Uh, mm. no. <laughs> Just because. Just because. Would it feel like cheating? Red clock. Red clock. Red clock. He changed I'm so proud of you. Thank you. You got a red clock. I, I tried my hardest. Wonderful job. I now have a red clock. And you can it's go find it. I can go, I can go hang this. Design. I can hang this up in my dorm, but just to be annoying, only upside down. Absolutely. So that you really got a strain to look at what time it is. Mm -hmm. You'll confuse everyone. Let's be honest. Most kids can't tell time with that kind of clock can anymore. Clocks, yeah. I can tell time with that Can you? Clock. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. This I think we have two of because I think we have another box of it. I think you're right. But we'll open the other box just to be sure. Oh man, a 
can't see it out. What? <laughs> Look at that. It's a happy cat? I am not sure. With <laughs> I don't... Chinese script. Is that a cat? Does it say anything on the bottom that could give us a clue no, what it means? But it's really fun. Hopefully it's not inappropriate words, you know. It's um a stone. It's cool. It is neat. It's a fun little figurine. It's a happy cat. Somebody, somebody's gonna love the happy cat. Yeah. You're doing good, Heather. A lot of unique pieces in yeah, this, you know? There is a lot of unique pieces All right, in this. I'm one. gonna go with this one. The wedding box. What in the world? Mm. So Oh it's it's a box. You, you build. build it? Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Is there anything else in there? Has all kind of, is it like for cards, you think? Yeah. You put it has the a card. slit right here. Yeah, it wait, does. Wait, wait. Does it not have all its pieces? <laughs> yeah, so, I think it does. It, well, there are four sides. Well, one side's going to be probably open. Well, then why is there a slit? They'll sl they, you slide this over a cardboard box. Are you sure? No. <laughs> this is uh, something. We'll maybe see if we can build it before we do yeah. the ending. I, I think it's probably all there, though. Or it's not all there. I'm never all there. I'm, I'm not all there either. Yeah. All right, this is... Wait, wait, wait. Does that pivot? What do you mean? Like, this piece goes in those holes. Oh, the little thingies right here? Goes... It's on a slant. There you go. So. I don't know how it works, though. No, I think it's... It, I think because these go like that. It goes that way, and then this piece just pivots like this. Oh, I see what you're saying. I think. Maybe. So it goes like that. Oh, here, watch. Put that in there. We have to build this up. I we do apologize. We're we're already we're invested, we're invested this much. There we go. And then this. Does it go like? Or we're missing a piece. <laughs> oh, oh, that's what you need right there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're missing the that's size. What, you know what? Maybe you're not. Maybe it's supposed to be just like that. It's very jinky yep, wedding box. Just like that. <laughs> Only slightly at an angle. Just it's like the leaning, oh, you know what? If you had your wedding in the leaning tower piece, it'd be perfect. Uh huh. There you go. This, That's what we need. This is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite. Shapes is favorite. Uh, I wonder why that didn't sell. <laughs> <laughs> Cloud City. Cloud City? Like from Star Wars? Yeah, Cloud City was Star Wars, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm shocked that that came out of my brain. You're amazing. All right. We have a purple velvet box. Please be Star Wars. Please, Please be, be Star lightsaber. Wars. It's right in <gasps> a lightsaber inside the box. Oh. Oh, it's a really nice jewelry box. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I a beautiful this... jewelry box. That's right. Chewbacca used to keep all of his stuff in there. In yeah, Cloud in City. a purple box, too. Mm -hmm. Chewbacca might have liked purple. We don't know. All right. All right, there we go. There's that. So what do you have? You have two more things here? Two more. You've yep. got two more. So James, we should be down to just two here. I'm going to go with this one. Of course. Let's see. Oh, it's a topper for a flagpole, I think. Is it? Yeah. It could be a topper for anything. It could be a topper for anything. This is Eagle. amazing. I feel like you need to put that on the front of your car. Beautiful. Yes, James. <laughs> it's a hood <laughs> ornament. Awesome. This would be awesome. That would be great. You won't be able to see traffic in front of you because it's so huge. <laughs> Very good. All right, over here. I think we oh. got one of these the last time. Yeah, I think we did. Plant. Goes with the wedding box. Mm. Yeah, it goes really <laughs> well with the wedding box. <laughs> It's already falling apart. <laughs> uh, and I think this was like a little uh, container to put it in. Yeah, like a cute little mason jar. It's like basically already made centerpieces. 
Nice. Put some rocks in there, like some glass beads, and then just... Or goldfish. Oh, goldfish. Goldfish. Goldfish swimming around. Yeah. We used to have a plant, a water plant, with yeah, we a did. fish. Well, I did. I had a fish tank for a while. Yeah. Okay. So you got one more? Yeah, do you want me to just open Yeah, mine? why don't we go ahead and open yeah. your last one there. Yeah, how'd the fish tank go? Uh, oh. My fish lasted, well, Dad's fish tank lasted I, a while. My uh, fish tank kept getting dirty. and I guess I guess our last name is Hooks. We don't really do well with fish. Okay, this is like a, a skull, like those uh, candy skulls. Ooh, scary. Halloween-y. And then this one is same thing but purple. That's what you need. Yep. Some skull diamond dots. Absolutely. All right, James, last item right here. Yeah, no, this one says American flat, so. It probably was supposed to mean American flag. Uh, <laughs> but. That gives me, that gives me a lot of Well, hope. and then you'd have the topper for your flagpole. Yes. Please be America, please be America. What do we got, James? Picture. Oh. It is a British telephone box. Yeah, America. Yeah. Nothing screams America like a British like a British phone, phone box. box. There we go. Now it's America. Now it's America. <laughs> oh, 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 the British have taken over again. <laughs> That's I'm, actually a really neat picture. It is a neat picture, it though. It is a neat picture. Yeah. And Screams America. Screams America. If it was a blue one, we could totally like market it as Doctor Who. Yeah, you could. <laughs> you could. All right, so now you're going to go through, and you'll find all the prices, and it'll be a total surprise for us, so we're going to disappear while he finds all the prices. Who's going to win, James or Heather? I think James with the wedding box. Oh, with the wedding box? That's true, James. Clearly. Clearly, the wedding box is going to win the day. I am here to win. You are here to win. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I would guess my things are probably more expensive. I don't know. I got some pretty good products. The wedding box is... The office set. That's actually pretty nice. The and office set the cool is nice. Plant. Random eagle. The many flamingos. Many flamingos. <laughs> There's things to push you over the top, I'm yep. sure. All right, so we'll come right back with all the prices. All right, we're back, and Paul has put all of the prices on, so we have no idea what the totals are, but we're going to mm -hmm. go through and show you how much each and every item is worth. If you are interested in any of these items, you need to shoot us an email at hookedonpicking at gmail.com. It's down in the description below, and you'll be able to um, go ahead and um, uh, basically it's a first-come, first-served basis. So if you send us an email and say, hey, I want to buy that Diamond Dot set of The Lion King, or I want to buy the, uh, the broken wedding box... <laughs> You just let us it's know, beautiful. and um, we'll, uh, you know, we'll put that item in, and then, uh, you know, we'll box it, and uh, we'll send an invoice your direction. All right, so uh, so let's go ahead and find out how much everything is worth. Yep. Who wants to start us? Uh, Heather? Uh, how about uh, paper, rock, scissors? Rock, pepper, scissors. Yep. Scissor, paper, ready? rock. Ready? One, <laughs> I win. Okay, so we'll start with me. Absolutely. Okay, okay here's your first item right here. Filter? First item was the filter. Four dollars. Apparently goes to some kind of Wi-Fi something or other system that needs a filter. needs a filter. Okay. There you go. Uh, your second uh, most valuable item was the Lion King Diamond Dot. Seven bucks. Yeah, that's actually what, pretty good. What I did is I take uh, the Amazon price and I basically cut it in half. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of how I've been doing the prices. Okay. So people get a good deal that way. You're at 11. And then let's see. Boom. This is the set of the skull stuff. Was that Diamond Dot again? Yeah. $8 for the set. Okay. Number nine. I can't remember what scent that candle is. This or is number four. Um, French Cade and Lavender. And that is nine dollars okay it's a pretty box i love this pillow your fifth item the fun pillow the fun pillow nine bucks okay not bad i can see it oh you got some good yeah some amounts. hefty dollar amounts here your sixth item ten bucks ten bucks <laughs> oceans what is it? of flowers basically it's like a centerpiece so. i like it yep and ten dollars for the uh cool uh fancy pants fancy pants hangers Ten bucks. That's actually really nice. Those yeah, are nice. They're pretty color too. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh my goodness. Twelve fifty for I this know. guy. That what really is he? surprised me. 
Uh, basically, like he's a... supposed to be like a little decorative stone, whatever, happy something or other. Okay. Wasn't anything major significance. It didn't say exactly what it was, the uh, the script on there either. So. Okay. 1250 And then our velvety jewelry box, $15. Yeah. And then our Rolling Stone, or ACDC, not Rolling ACDC, so. that, would, that was the most expensive item that you had wow. out of the whole box. That's really 20 awesome. bucks. Twenty bucks, so we did good. right there. That's pretty good. All right. All right. I will share your total here in just a little okay. bit. There. Down to James's. And to James. Are you Are ready you, for your first I, item? I am excited. This Boom. has got to be a million dollars. I gave you one penny. <laughs> yes. One. Yes. Single just penny. For the wood value. <laughs> this is supposed to. When I looked it up, it's supposed to come with, uh, of course, one side that says Mr. and Mrs., which mm -hmm. you're missing, also as a locking mechanism. Oh. But we do not have that. I mean, it looks pretty secure to me. It, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's when you wonder, will the marriage last if yes. you had to put your cards in that thing and be like, oh boy. And your second most expensive item were the three hooks. I think cast iron hooks. The three hooks are seven dollars. Um, are are priceless. Yep. Yep. A herd of flamingos. Okay. <laughs> so when I look this up. Long. It's not supposed to have a bunny rabbit with it. Oh. You got a free bunny rabbit. I got a free a bunny bonus, rabbit. A bonus That's, bunny. It's pretty amazing when you think about it. Yeah. How did a bunny rabbit get in with flamingos? It wasn't Look. even supposed to be in there. I don't know. But you got it. That is your prize. $9 <laughs> for the set of flamingos. Eagle. Mm -hmm. goes supposed to go to the top of a flagpole. Uh, 10 bucks. Mm -hmm. Not bad. And then you got several things that are 10 Red clock. The red, red clock. clock. It's actually a pretty big clock. It's yeah. a good size clock. Mm -hmm. And I thought this was going to be more, but ten bucks. All right. Yeah. I'll take it. Yep. Yeah. And then you've got this set here. The whole set is just ten dollars. Wow. I thought wow. that was a good deal too. So I think there's six in the box. Hmm. James's hat. Yep. Twelve dollars and fifty cents. Or plant. Mm -hmm. plant or, or plant. It's shocking how much fake plants actually cost. It is. Mm -hmm. I think that little. Uh, the base. The base is what's probably pushing that to twelve fifty two, because they were like twenty four ninety nine on uh, wow. Amazon, which I'm like, wow. It's okay. really pretty though. And then, my loving grandpa is worth fifteen dollars. Okay, I'll take it. Grandpa's worth fifteen. Good <laughs> job. And this was your most expensive item. Wow. 20 bucks. Yeah. For the office set. 20 bucks for the and office set. And you get a really bad cup. And a really bad cup. Yeah. Goes to with water it there. your plant. To water, to water to my To water plant. your fake plant. I seriously mm -hmm. think you should water your fake plant. All, All right, right, guys. Uh, so here's the deal on this here. This was the closest battle we have ever had when it comes to jewelry wars, unboxing wars, wow. or any of it. I'm calling it this one, man. It was within a dollar. Oh. It was within one dollar difference okay so who did we start with we started with me okay so your total was a hundred and four dollars and fifty cents okay a wow. hundred and four dollars and fifty cents wow. james your total was a hundred and three dollars and fifty one cents a hundred and three dollars and fifty one cents heather you 99 won cents difference. you won by yes. 99 cents wow, congratulations guess. heather oh man All i right. feel like you should have given him extra money for the extra bunny <laughs> That's true. The bunny was extra. Yes. Mm. Um, so you guys get to pick a prize. So since I win, I get to pick the first prize. That's right? true. Because what is Heather going to pick on the table? Mm. Well, it can be from anything from the box and on the table. Correct. Uh, correct. All right. I think. Hmm. I don't know. What does Heather want? Look at all these treasures, I Heather. Know. That's what I'm thinking. So many treasures. So many Please pick treasures. the air filter. It doesn't <laughs> even go to anything that we have. Um, I don't know. I think she's actually from. I don't know. I'll probably pick the candle. The candle. She's gonna go with the candle. Let me look or not? Real fast. Nope. <laughs> she changed her mind. Oh. The nondescript pink box. That is supposed to be a wedding favor. Okay. It's just a box. They're sold individually as boxes. Okay. I think I'll probably take some of these little party packs. Heather wants the party packs. Because I'm a, I'll probably use them for something. Yeah, you will. Yep. Definitely. Okay, so that's what I'm going to take. All right, James. Hmm. Well, I mean, this is tempting. 
just to put it in my dorm room and exactly. ask no questions. Exactly. We'll probably get thrown away. I feel like um, the eagle should go in your dorm room. The eagle's pretty fun, pretty fun, but I don't know where I would actually be yeah. able to put it. On your hood. Um, flamingos would be interesting. Uh, I think so. I'm probably going to just take the plant. because You're going to yeah. take the plant? Because yeah. my room has nothing. It has no life it, in it. It has five guys in it. No one decorates. So it's just kind of like You're gonna blank take the plant walls. Put, are you going to put stuff. it in the middle of the table? I'm just going to put it right in the center of the table. You should put it in the <laughs> weirdest place, though. It should. Top you should, of the like, microwave. Hang it from the ceiling. Put, start it in the table, and then every day, move it to a different spot. You could do that too. <laughs> so James is going to take the plant. Okay. Heather's going to take the party so boxes. Party boxes. Yep. Well done. Well All done, right. guys. So if you're interested in any of these items, um, go ahead and send us an email at hookedonpicket at gmail.com or go to hookedonpicket.com, click to contact me and shoot us an email and say, James and Heather's Unboxing Wars, I would like, and then let us, give us a description and the price that we put on the description so, um, so that we can send you, we can find this item and send it to you. So thanks so much for joining us. And of course, remember in the end, Jesus wins. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. If you'd like to watch more of my videos, just click on them here. And if you'd like to learn more about the reseller world, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. Thanks.